Crossing the Atlantic on a wave of publicity, the Lino Constitution carried Grace Kelly, her parents, and another 80 relatives and friends in true Hollywood style to Monaco. Throughout the voyage, whether playing deck games with her two nieces or enjoying the company of her pets, Grace has seldom escaped the headlines, the price of being the Hollywood star who won the heart of the eligible Prince Renier. A happy moment, a cable from her future husband as the liner arrives off the coast of Monaco. Smiling skies greeted the occasion, so the prince was able, after all, to sail in the honeymoon yacht, Deo Gervante II, to greet his lovely young bride and escort her to his kingdom. On board the Constitution, Miss Kelly had been welcomed with Riviera Blooms by the Mayor of Cannes, accompanied by other civic dignitaries. Then, with the arrival of the Royal Yacht, escorted by hundreds of tiny craft alongside the liner, one of the most romantic meetings of modern times took place, again in true Hollywood style. Prince Renier of Monaco had been joined by his lovely bride, and together they sailed into the harbour to receive the ready acclaim of the happy people. Monaco ready to take her to its heart, Grace Kelly leaves the yacht. Already with the assured poise of a princess, she graciously accepts a bouquet from a tiny Monegasque dressed in national costume. At the Royal Palace, the guards, members of one of the world's smallest armies, are ready to receive their prince and future princess. And as an accompaniment to the drive through the tiny kingdom, the cheers of welcome rang out. So the Prince of Monaco brought his betrothed to her future hilltop home, a castle of dreams that came true for a lovely American girl.